Behind computer screens on the other side of the world, a hacker found a weak link, infiltrating the systems of file transfer service Go Anywhere, one of its customers, the Tasmanian government. Our investigations have found that there is a risk that financial data from the Department of Education, Children and Young People may have been accessed. The data believed to be at risk includes names, addresses, invoices and bank account numbers. The government says there's no proof that hackers have accessed the data, but it won't say whether it's teachers, contractors, suppliers or parents whose data is at risk. Our investigations are ongoing, but I can say information will be provided through headmasters to schools and more broadly than that. The government says it found out about the hack 11 days ago. The public was notified almost a week later, after investigations deemed it credible. On Monday, the minister held a press conference. At this time, I can say we are not aware that any government information has been released. Two days later, it's now clear the personal data was at risk. She sat on this information for six days. Uh, the Premier is avoiding scrutiny and the story is changing. I want to deal in facts, information and an evidence-based approach to this. The people of Tasmania deserve that. The government says the investigation is being handled by the Australian Cyber Security Centre. It wouldn't answer if they've been contacted by the hackers or if they've been asked for a ransom. Adam Langenberg, ABC News.